going on, the friends? My name is M2 Degrees, and welcome back to another episode of New Super Luigi U Deluxe. Uh, last time, uh, we got through Frosted Glacier, the um, ice swirl. Uh, and now, in this part, we are going to um, go through uh, World 5, which is Soda Jungle. Uh, so, let's go ahead and get started with the first level here. Uh, this first level is kind of annoying. Um, and, um, we'll see why in just a moment. Uh, okay, let's, uh, go ahead and do that. Okay, alright, that's, uh, that can, that can actually be scary. Um, for, uh, a first coin. Um, yeah, there's a first, yeah, this is our coin right here, up in this little area. Um, and, um, it's, a uh, pretty scary one to get. Uh, but thankfully we are going to get no problem just like that. Um, alright. Then this uh, next one right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and wait for that. Wait for those things, and uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully these guys are nice. Okay, good. Those guys were Those guys were nice. Uh, that's that's a firefly right there. We're gonna keep going. Um, then we're gonna use this guy. Uh, kick him because we're gonna use him. Um, you know, it's uh, kind of bad when you use people, but uh, you know we we're gonna use people for a good cause, and we just and we just use that guy for a good cause. Except he fell in the poison water, so maybe it's a good and bad cause. Um, I don't know, but um, we we dealt with that guy, and and that guy was uh, that that guy was nice. All right, uh, let's see what to do. Which level should I do next? I think I'm gonna do this level next because this level sucks. This is five dash three, and th and this is a bad level, bad, bad, bad level. Um, and that's because this level is full of brambles, and the brambles have bad hitboxes, and it's a it's a mess. And oh my god, yeah, that's a, that's another reason why why the brambles are bad. Um, they are absolute nonsense. How did I hit that guy? I, I will never know. Um, oh my god! Oh my god, help me! Help me! Oh my gosh, are you serious? Oh, okay, okay, we gotta, we gotta go, we gotta go. Alright, uh, oh! Oh my god, we got through that level. Okay. Wow, that was, that was crazy. Um, I don't know, I don't know about you guys, but I was, I was kind of scared. I think I was I think I was about to be on my edge of my seat right there on that on that last part cuz I thought I was a goner. All right. Now we can go we, now we can do the somewhat easier stuff. Uh, and I say easier because uh uh well, it's uh, it's not as bad. It's not, it's definitely not as bad. So, but uh, the uh, more what's uh, a little bit annoying about this level is that uh oh man okay we gotta okay i i'm not okay my cycles are up because i have to go out of my way to get to power myself up power myself back up because um uh, because uh we had to uh grab um ourselves a, a super crown that way we don't uh, die i'm gonna go ahead and pick, grab that circle like that um if you don't have to do it like that but i choose to do it like that um, that's bad. Uh, thank you! Okay, let's, uh, let's go ahead and, uh, you know, beat the level, just like that. Yeah, the, there are those little moving blocks right there. Those moving blocks are kind of, or, well, um, you kind of have to, uh, know your way around the moving blocks, and it's kind of a pain. No, it's not kind of a pain. Um, but, uh, we're gonna do this all again. Uh, cause you probably, cause you played Mario, you know there's a secret level, this, uh, there's a secret, uh, secret exit in this level. I'm like, I don't think I know what I'm saying. Uh, it's 10 p.m. I should be sleeping. No, I'm sleeping at 10 p.m. But, uh, um, other people sleep, other people sleep at 10 p.m. Um, and, uh, I should be, uh, this isn't, isn't really the time to be recording this. Uh, there's a, there's normally a hard, a harder way I, I go about with that, with, with, with that. But, um, you know what, I have to take it safe there because this is a let's play. And, and during a let's play, I kind of have to play things safe. Um, because I don't make up the rules, uh, for LPs, uh, because I'm not the one who invented nice Let's Plays. Um, so, yeah. Lovely. Also, I'm kind of on a streak on this game, in this particular game. Um, so I have to kind of keep it up, in my opinion. Um, so there we go. Um, hey, who is that that I just see right there? I think, I think we're gonna go ahead and go after that guy. That guy, that guy looks like a nice guy. IMO. In my IMO. I thought I got a text message because I just heard my phone vibrate, but no. 
All right, let's, let's go. Let's go ahead and catch this guy. This guy's gonna be a meaty head, I, I bet. All right, bring it on, sir. Bring it on, Nabbit. By the way, uh, today's a day where I achieved my first, my uh, well, it's not my first, my second's completed 100% speedrun of uh, New Super Mario Bros. U. And uh, I got less than four. I just beat it in less than four hours, and that's impressive. I just need something to talk about. <laughs> so it's it's nothing it's nothing relevant to the. Uh, the, the the video here, although it is New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe related, which is what we're playing, except we're playing New Super Luigi U, so I, I, I think there's a difference. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, get rid of uh, our propeller suit right there, and uh, just so I can get PA corn, and speaking of PA corn, so that is what we're gonna be using today. All right, here we go. Right, you guys ready to see a sickle strat? All right, so normally in this level right here, you have to ride this like giant block snake, but screw the rules. Yes. All right, all right we gotta we gotta play a little bit safe here. Okay, let's. Uh, that's not good. All right. all right, cool. All right, cool. All right, cool. All right, that's the hard part right there. We 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 did we got past the hard part. Oh my god. Okay. All right, all right, that was the hard part right there. All right, we, we, we redeemed ourselves because uh, if you all remember back in our Mario playthrough, I, uh, I, I, I messed that up pretty badly, and um, uh, I'm glad I got my revenge this time, except it's kind of not fair to compare uh, because uh, the levels are different between the two games. Um, but, uh, you know, we, we, we managed to get our revenge, and, that, and that's good. All right, get out of here, boom boom. All right, boom boom is a little bit easier in, in this uh, in this game because because you can jump really high, and you can jump super high, and uh, gain all the height that you would like, and uh, we beat the boss. That was a uh, giant boom boom right there, who's uh, who has a big old hitbox, so it's uh, a lot of room to hit him, but then also a lot of room to hit for him to hit you, and it could be scary. Um, but thankfully, none of it went out of hand, and that's good on our part. All right, and now we're going to head down to glue to the gloomy section. Uh, it's called well, I call it gloomy forest, but the game calls it haunted forest, which I think makes more sense because this forest is indeed haunted. Um, it's not haunted as in like it's not as haunted as the forest maze though. Uh, well, actually, actually, it's a little bit more haunted than the forest maze. I am out. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna grab the star right here, um, just so we can get through his blue ring a lot easier. And uh, if you go ahead and, and head down over here, there, not only is your third star coming, but you want to go inside this door over here. Um, you can actually make, believe it or not, um, you can actually make this, uh, make that big old jump without a super acorn. But the game wants you to have a super acorn, so you have to do it with, with the super. So you have to get it with, with, with the super acorn. But if you are really, really good, um, you can actually make that that big old jump without a super acorn. Um, uh, you can also do it even without a star as well, but it's kind of a, a dumb jump. Uh, but it's possible. I've done it like three times in my life. Uh, but you can very well do it. It's kind of hard, but uh, it's possible. You be believe me. Believe me, it's possible. Um, now we're going to do this level again. Uh, because that's the secret exit, uh, not the normal exit. I mean, it's a secret exit because it's, uh, it's harder than the, uh, well, it's, that was harder to find than the regular exit, you know? Um, I mean, the secret exit cannot be uh, easier to find than the uh, normal exit. It's called a secret exit, but it's called secret exit. It wouldn't be called secret exit if there was no secret behind the levels. Right? I think so. All right, there's not really much. There's not really much to talk about right now. But I, all, all I could say is that I just beat. I just beat uh, that ghost house. That's the first out of the three of these levels right here. We're going through these relatively quickly, uh, and that's great on our part. All right, so now we got two very painful levels right here. Um, I think I'm going to uh, get this level out of the way first, um, just because. Um, well. I don't like 5-5, five five, um, at all, uh, but, um, 
Well, I don't like either one of these levels. I don't like. I I personally per I hate five four more, but we're gonna five five first. Um, just because that was scary. Oh my gosh. I don't, I, I don't know. I don't know about that, about that but right there. Okay, we're gonna squeeze on through. We're just gonna keep on swimming. Um, this is where uh, this is where having this is where swimming is very useful with, with Toadette. Oh my God! I hate I hate that nonsense right there. I can't believe that. I think, I'm gonna, I, think I, uh, I call it hacks for, for that uh, dang old bony beetle just uh, uh, getting me as I get that star coin. Um, that star coin used to be a huge pain back in the OG uh, game, the original game. Uh, but um, now, but um, now it's a lot easier because when you're Toadette, you don't have to worry about um, you don't have to worry about much. You can just get that star coin, just quickly get out. Uh, Cause back then, when you had like the regular swim mechanics, you get that star coin. That and that that stone eye just gets you. Um, well, he has a chance of getting you. Um, for the reason that you can actually uh, just get stuck and uh, and you just do not use. You just kind of get stuck there, you, you, and then you just you just pray, you just die and cry um, because he, he he squishes you. You know, it's not good. It's not good when you when you, when you cry just because uh, you got you got squish. Um, and it's kind of a painful feeling to, to get squish because you just die. And, you know, w nobody li nobody likes dying. Uh, in most cases. So in case you guys haven't figured it out, that was a that was a pretty tough secret exit. Again, this game is keeping up with its uh, uh, reputation that secret exits are very obscure. Um, because I don't know how in the world anybody would ever figure that figure that secret exit out. That's probably the hardest secret exit in the game, right there. The hardest secret exit. Um, just saying. Um, all right, now we got this level right here. So um, the uh, last level, um, it was uh, called uh, Painted Floodlands, I believe it was called in, Mar in uh, New Super Mario Brothers U. Now in this game, now in this one, it's called Painted Pipeworks. And you know what? Um, I like to make. I, I joke about the, the the level title because it has because it has the word pain in the word painted, and that's because and that and the reason I emphasize the word pain is because this level is indeed very very painful. No, no! Oh my gosh! I that was scary. All right, all right. Let's let's get this. Okay. I just I don't want to I don't want to cause any more trouble. Um, because that was that that could have been a lot worse than what I just encountered. Um, oh man. Thankfully, uh, thankfully it wasn't too bad. Uh, so by the way, in case you haven't figured it out, uh, you have to get, uh, at least one of the secret exits of either one of these levels in order to get out of here. Um, but, uh, since this is a 100% playthrough, we're going to, uh, we're going to, we're going to show you guys how to get the secret exits of, uh, both these levels. And I just got the normal exit today. Well, 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 we, we've been doing all, all this stuff today, but, uh, I, we, we, uh, we got the, um, we, we just got the normal exit. Now we're going to get the secret exit, which is up in this pipe right here. By the way, that was a smooth level right there. Uh, a lot more smooth than, uh, uh, when we, uh, almost died. Um, because that would have been, that would have been scary. Because uh, that would have meant, meant that my streak is gone. And by streak, well, I don't want to say it because um, that would ruin my streak. And I don't want to ruin my streak right now. I don't, I'm, I just don't feel like it. Alright. So, um, that's going to take us out of the gloomy forest. But, um, you don't want to, you don't want to get out of there that way. That way, is, it just sucks. Um, there's a bunch of booze um, that you have to get past. And um, the boos just kind of, they, they're, they're placed in like random spots and you have to guess which boo is in whichever panel. And it's kind of a pain because you can, because uh, you don't know, well, it's going to look like a boo goes inside of a panel. But then when you actually go into that panel, sometimes the boo is not there. Uh, and, and then other times when you walk to another panel, the boo is, the boo will just be there and gets you into random. The pain, I don't want to deal with that nonsense. So, you know. Screw that! And so I'm gonna get. I'm so I'm gonna get this uh, gloomy forest uh, the the other way, the, the really fancy dancy way. I'm not gonna pick up those red dreams right there because uh, those red dreams they 
a super crown, but I don't want it. Because I don't feel like getting it. So, uh, here's the uh, Parabeetle level of this game. Um, it is very easy, surprisingly. Because, you know, in New Super Mario Bros. Wii, you know, Parabeetle level in that game was like a ridiculous pain. But, and then, uh, in, uh, wait, hold on, I need a... No! This run, th this run sucks. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Um, there's a running theme where if I... Where if you get a 36, your run's valid in the speed run. But if you get a 35, then your run sucks no matter what you do, and therefore it's not valid. <laughs> um, but uh, this is a let's play, not a speed run, so I guess it does. So I guess it's okay to uh, accept the 35. But um, normally, but if I was doing a speed run temp, I would actually reset because it's not valid. Uh, but anyway, um, here's the here's the mess that you would have to go through if you really want to do that. Um, see, look at that. Uh, no thanks. It's random, by the way. It looks like the booze went inside of one of those panels right there. Nah, you're wrong. You can be wrong. So instead, we're gonna get out. We're gonna get out of here through this way, and this is the path that that you would uh, that you would take if you got the secret exit of Five Dash Two. So we're gonna get out of here this way. That way, we don't have to deal deal with all that randomness and it. Uh, yeah, all that randomness bullcrap. That's a bull crap. I don't want to deal with bull crap. I want to deal with stuff the fun way. Alright, uh, this, uh, level here... Oh, man. Uh, this level's hard. Real hard. Alright, let's go into this pipe right here. Uh, I, I just went to that pipe the really fast and aggressive way. That's not easy. Um, what? I dodged a star coin? Oh my gosh, I've never done that before. Thankfully, this is, thankfully that has happened in a Let's Play, otherwise I get really tilted. Uh, but this, but this, since this is a Let's Play, I don't get tilted, so, um, yeah. Alright, there we go, we got, we got that. And that's the end of the level right there. Oh my god, I got 99 lives in Wolf 5. Man, that's, uh, that's, it's not easy to get, n get 99 lives in this game, uh, cause you die a lot, but, um, you know, we got 99 lives, so I guess that's good on our part. Alright, that's gonna take, that's gonna take me to the castle. I don't need to go to the castle right now, we got one more level to do. And this is, a uh, 5-7 Wiggler Floodlands. This level's a huge pain, uh, because of the first star coin. Only the first star coin. No, actually, no, it's the second star coin. This is the first star coin right here. The second star coin is what, I, is what I'm talking about. That star coin is a huge mess. Let's see if I can get it. Alright, uh, hold on. Alright. Okay, that's step one. Okay, we got it. Alright, good. Alright. Uh, we didn't have to didn't have to deal with some uh, nonsense right there. It didn't go too out of hand. Um, if you are uh, playing as Luigi, uh, you can actually uh, the, the the way that I the way that I broke that wall, you can actually break both of the bottom blocks if you're playing as Luigi. But because Toad's hit, Toadette's hitbox is different, uh, that's not so much the case right there. I'm gonna wait. Yeah, that's not so much the case. Um, so I had to do so I had to do that strat differently because we're Toadette, not not Luigi. Um, and therefore it makes that star coin a little bit harder, but, um, because, um, you don't slide very much when you're, uh, a super acorn, but, um, believe it or not. So it's, uh, not easy, but we got it. Alright, now we're gonna do, uh, Iggy's Castle. This level sucks, also. Uh, there's these, uh, uh, waves of lava. I almost died! No! Oh my gosh! How could I let that happen? Uh, dang it, man! And here I here I am saying that I got a streak going, and oh man, my streak is gone. Oh, I'm sad. This game makes me sad all the time. Anyway, um, that was the first coin right there. Um, the second coin's right here. Or, no, actually, that's the third coin. Uh, here's the, 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 the- Oh! 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 Okay, okay, let's, let's, uh, let's play it safe. Oh my god, I almost, di I almost died again. That would've been bad. 
Alright, alright, we're good. We're good. Alright, hard stuff is hard stuff is out of the way. Alright, notice how I got the third coin and then the second coin. That's how spread apart these coins are. Uh, alright. That's good on our part. Right, we only got one death. And uh, not not being able not being able to die up until this point of the game is actually pretty impressive on its own. So I guess I shouldn't be too uh, embarrassed about that. Um, but that's kind of a shame because that's a, a very not a very that's a very easy way to not die right there. And I and I can't believe I died the, the hard the the not the hard way. That's a hard way to die. Um, but anyway. Um, here we are, we're finding Iggy. Um, Iggy's a jerk. I hate Iggy. Iggy's probably my, uh, my least favorite kind of playing out of the, the group in this game. At least, Iggy's usually not that bad in other Mario games, but in this game, Iggy is stupid. Get out of here. Alright, I need to hit him one more time. Um, this guy causes a lot of problems sometimes. Alright, he's gotta count four pipe entrances, like that. Four, that was four, and there we go. Alright, there we go, I got my revenge. That's revenge. Your castle killed me, and I, and, I, and I defeated you for defeating me in your freaking castle. And your airship is also going down as well. Take that, son. Alright, so we got through... That was Soda Jungle right there. That was, uh, that was fun. I had fun. Did y'all have fun? I hope y'all had fun. I had fun. I always have fun. Except when I'm playing this game in particular. Because this game's not fun. Alright, well anyway. Thanks everybody for watching. And next time, we're gonna go head on forward to, uh... Uh, the next world is Rock Candy Mines. And this time I remembered to save, so that way I don't have one try to do all these episodes. 